Alright, I'm back after that scan. Um, unfortunately, I accidentally rebooted. Um, so, I can't really show you what it found, but it, I can tell you it found 239 items and removed them all. And you can see that down here, uh, my tray looks very normal. I don't have any pop ups. My CPU is pretty much normal. RAM usage, I've got 300 left over. My processes, pretty standard stuff. I don't see any other malware-related malware, uh, processes at all. Uh, I'm going to try to get on the internet. Let me do a search. And Google has blocked me. Um, this happens sometimes when I'm testing. Uh, I'm not sure what causes it. Probably this virtual machine doing a bunch of port scanning. Um, so I can't really test internet functionality. Uh, so, not much else I can say really um, because Google has blocked me. Let me try Yahoo. Let's do a search for antivirus. Okay, Yahoo is allowing me to search. I'm going to the real Symantec site. Let's see if we go to the McAfee site. Yeah. No browser redirection, even in Internet Explorer. Um, if I do a search for, oh, let's see, Combo Fix is one that they redirect a lot. And uh, looks all pretty much perfect. Uh, it, you know, speaking from a Yahoo search. Okay, so um, I really like Bit Bitdefender. I think it's a slick uh, application. Um, it got rid of all the fake stuff, the fake uh, anti-malware, the rogue applications. Um, I don't have any uh, any suspicious processes going on in the background anymore. Uh, as you can see right there, this looks pretty much normal. Uh, CPU usage is back down to almost nothing and normal. Got plen plenty of RAM left over. Um, and all I have to do now is go fix my internet connection. Um, so that's it. I liked Bitdefender a lot. I'll give it five stars. It does what it says. It removes uh, all kinds of stuff. So I don't really know how much else to put it, but that's about it. Great application. Anyway, i got to get back to my uh, vacation here. Talk to you guys later.